In this video, we will show you how to add a dashboard tile and edit its layout. We will explain how you can add tiles to your dashboard, create your data set by adding the search criteria, edit your chart layout, and edit the formatting options. To access your dashboard, click on Dashboard in the Navigator menu on the left-hand side. To add or edit a tile, click on the Task button on the right-hand side. In the Task menu, you can click Add Tile Edit Layout. You will now see the Add Tile Edit Layout menu on the right-hand side of the screen. When you click on the drop-down menu behind the View field, you'll see all the different views you can choose from. Each view contains a series of predefined tiles that you can add to your dashboard, and each view contains an empty tile. The empty tile allows you to build your own tile from scratch. If you are looking for a specific tile in the view, you can search for it using the search field. This way, you can filter out all tiles containing specific information. Next, select and drag your tile from the view list to your dashboard or use the Add button that appears when you hover your mouse over the name of the tile to add it. The tile will now load and show you a graph, chart, numbers or a list of information, depending on the type of tile you chose to add. You can change the size of the tile by hovering over it with your mouse and dragging the corners into the desired position. In the top right corner of each tile, you'll see two buttons. The circle with the cross through it allows you to remove the tile and the square with the pen allows you to edit it. Click on the Edit button to open the Edit Tile dialog. This dialog contains two tabs, the Dataset and the Layout tab. In the Dataset tab, you control what data you wish to extract from SuperOffice CRM and in the Layout tab, you can decide how you want to present your information. All predefined tiles contain specific search criteria to visualize, in this case, my weighted forecast. You can add, change and delete search criteria if needed. To add a search criterion, click on the plus add button. You can now add the field you want to search for in your database. Click on the field name that is first on the criteria line you've added. A drop-down menu containing all the fields in SuperOffice CRM will appear. Each field that you add or change will contain its own specific drop-down menus that you can use to build your dataset. You can delete a criterion by clicking the Delete button on the right-hand side of the Edit Tile dialog. When you've added all the search criteria you want to use, you can open the Layout tab and check how your tile looks. You can always go back to the Dataset tab to change your search criteria. The first and most important decision you'll have to make is to choose which chart type you want to use. You have nine options to choose from. You can choose a pie chart, big numbers, a list, column chart, a bar chart, a line chart, an area chart, a column plus line chart, and a bar plus line chart. Each chart will have its own specific fields that you have to consider when you choose a chart. For this video, we'll choose the column chart. Now let's decide how we want to measure the information from your dataset. Here we can count the total numbers, calculate the sum, calculate the average, see the max value or the minimum value. Let's select sum. Also, we want to see the sum of the weighted amount of all your sales. That's why we'll select the weighted amount from the drop down menu. Now let's choose which currency we want to use on the chart. The next field, called buy, allows you to group the information in your chart. You'll see that this tile is grouped by sales date. You can also group it by, for example, company categories. When you choose another field to group your information by, the tile will update immediately, so you'll see what the tile looks like with the field that you choose. You can choose any field available in SuperOffice CRM from the drop-down menu. When you're new to Dashboard, we recommend you to play around with the different fields and see which results they give you. This will help you to get a better understanding of the options you have. 
you are always able to cancel the changes you've made by clicking the cancel button in the bottom right corner of the edit layout dialog. Depending on the field you choose, SuperOffice CRM will offer you different fields to further customize your tile. For example, if you choose a field containing a date, you can set the period that the tile should show. You can choose from hour, day, all the way to a year. You can choose how you wish to group your data in every field. Depending on the chart type that you choose, you have several grouping options. You can choose not to group them, stack them, group them, or compare them to another time period or value. For this tile, we'll choose to stack by the columns. And finally, you can choose the field you want to use as the content for your columns. In this example, you see that the columns represent sold and open sales. To change the look of this tile, just choose a different field. For example, if you use a sales source, the tile will change and the columns will show different sales sources. To add even more information to the tile, you can fill out the formatting fields. You can add a title to the tile. You can add a title for the tile. You can add a title for the X and Y axis, and you can choose where to show the legend. The legend can be visible below, on the left, on the right, or above the chart. You can also choose which labels are visible in your columns. Here you can choose to show no labels, numbers only, percentages only, or both numbers and percentages. And finally, you choose how you want to sort your columns. You can sort them by value, rank, or label. When you've made all the changes you want to make and added all the information that should be visible on the tile, you can press save. Then click done in the top right corner to save the changes you've made to your dashboard. We have now shown you how to add a new dashboard tile and edit its layout. As you've seen in this video, the new dashboard feature offers you great flexibility and a larger range of options to visualize the information saved in your database. Thank you for watching. For more information on how to improve your productivity with SuperOffice CRM, please visit our community website.